Hi everyone, Niklas Seidloff here from IBM and OpenNTF. This video is the first one of a series of videos describing the new OpenNTF project XPages extension library. In this video I'm going to demonstrate some of the key new features and controls that can be consumed by XPages developers running on IBM Lotus Domino 852. At the end of this video I'll explain how to install the library to use the new controls in custom applications. The XPages extension library is the biggest contribution of new code that IBM has contributed to OpenNTF. Several people from the XPages development team are working on this project. Through OpenNTF we would like to get feedback in various ways from feature requirements up to code contributions from the community. There is a presentation describing the project on the project's homepage under xlib.openntf.org there's way too much content in this deck to cover in a short video. The first slides, however, describe well the goals of this project. The main goal is to make the development of web applications even simpler and faster. Typical applications and common patterns can be built rapidly, leveraging the new controls and prototyping of good-looking ap applications is easier than ever. The extension library has been implemented via Java and OSGI plugins using the new extensibility API in Lotus Domino 852. However, XPages developers can consume the controls in their custom applications, which they can continue to implement via the same JavaScript, HTML, CSS skills as in previous releases. Let me now demonstrate some of the new controls. Many of the newer IBM Lotus applications use a common look and feel, which people often refer to as One UI. The extension library allows creating new custom applications using this style within minutes, which is useful for example when developing prototypes. The extension library comes with a core library plus an NSF which shows how to use the controls. What you see here is the entry page of this NSF. This test application uses the One UI style. For example, you can see here the banner row, um, you can see the tabs, you can see the two or three column layout with the outline control in the left column, and you can see the footer. Also on the One UI tab, you can see um, examples for outline controls that you can um, collapse. Um, you can see a bread crumbs control and a simple widget container. The implementation of such a control is now more a declaration than actual development of code. In Domino Designer you can see the new controls showing up in the palette as all other out-of-the-box controls. For the One UI style you can drag and drop the application layout control onto your page which contains a hierarchy of subcontrols. For example, the um, three links that you can see here at the top, Home Application 2 and Application 3, can be declared right here, um, Home Application 2 and 3. The library also contains various new functions to handle notes views. For example, there is a new data view control which supports expandable layout sections as used in several Lotus applications. Here is such a data view control in action. You can expand and collapse these view entries and multiple ones of them. Um, and you can also, in addition to that, show the summaries of these view entries. And again, you can do that for multiple at the same time. Um, there's also additional columns that you can, um, can display here on the right hand side and you can categorize views. When you um, navigate back, the um, view context, the state, is preserved. Now in Domino Designer, you can declare and define many of these properties of the data view control. For example, here you can turn on and off collapsible rows. And for many other places and features, you have so-called facets where you can put in your own um, user interface and data. In addition to that, there is also a so-called um, grid control, Dojo grid control, which reads data from a notes view using REST APIs. And the other nice thing that it supports is you can edit the view entries here in line. The extension library comes with name and value picker controls. These controls define a model with exchangeable backends and frontends. 
For example, the data can be read in the backend from nodes views, REST services, beans, etc. The separation of these backend services from the actual control is one of the key benefits of the extension library. The user interface can also be customized or completely exchanged. Here are some simple samples. Here you can um, select one value, multiple values, and there is also um, samples for the name picker, which uses the standard type head functionality. So you can type something in, which starts with N, you can select the people here and click OK. There are also many other UI controls in the extension library that I want to quickly demonstrate. For example, there are controls to integrate the Lotus Connections business card, either as a pop-up or in line. When I go to the Core tab, um, there are controls for outline, like toolbar, a toolbar with a menu and submenus. Um, there are samples for in-context editing. Um, there are dialogues, dialogues that can actually um, contain forms now. I can bring them up either as toolbar, a uh, tooltip, or um, as modal dialogues. Um, there are controls, or there's a control for dynamic tabs. When I click on a last name here, you can see a new tab coming up here and multiple ones of them. Um, there is the notion of a dynamic page where I don't leave the page, and at the same position here, I display either views or con or um, documents. There are tooltips, etc., and there are um, a couple of new controls wrapping up dojo controls. That was the wrong one. Dojo form controls. For example, the spinner control comes out of the box, or the, um, the sliders. Um, and also, there are controls so that you can easily use dojo effects. Slide, and grow. And under the Domino tab, there is a Tech Cloud control as well. Another powerful set of functionality in the extension library is around REST services and JSON RPC. The extension library comes with predefined REST services for nodes, views, documents, the value pickers, etc., which can be utilized out of the box. These REST services can return data as XML or as JSON or in other formats. Furthermore, these services can be extended and custom services can be implemented. This functionality is a little bit hard to demonstrate in less than two minutes, but let me highlight some key points. When I click on this button here on my test page, I get data returned from my All Contacts view uh, as JSON. Now let's switch to Designer and see how that is um, done. There's this new control, REST Service, and in here I refer to my um, view, All Contacts. And you can also see that I actually um, append further columns, um, which can be either other columns from that view or any other data um, you know, that you calculate um, and, and read from anywhere else. So back to the, um, to the JSON, you can see these three um, additional um, columns right here. The library also um, allows writing server-side JavaScript which can be invoked easily from client-side JavaScript using remote procedure calls. The whole serialization and invocation is handled by a new control so that even complex JavaScript objects can be passed easily between client and server. Now, when you want to use this library, um, you need to install it in Domino Designer and on Domino. Um, in Domino Designer, go into your preferences and make sure this checkbox is selected, enable Eclipse plugin install, and then you can install the update site via application install. Um, on Domino, simply copy the um, plugins um, into your appropriate Domino directory. And then um, when you use the test application the first time, go to the administration, uh, administration page and create the sample data set. If you want to use the library in your own NSF, make sure you have selected One UI version 2 as the theme and under the Advanced tab, um, check the checkbox for the extension library. This was a quick overview of the XPages extension library. I hope you enjoyed it and go to OpenNTF, download it and try it out yourself.